Hey everyone, today we're making butterscotch caramel mousse. It is so light and creamy and delicious and chocolate cake on the inside is dense and rich and chocolatey. It is so good. So we're going to start off with some name brand butterscotch chips and I have some gelatin blooming with some heavy cream and some butter vanilla and then I have some super hot boiling cream that I'm adding to my butterscotch chips and I'm just going to wait for that to melt. So once my gelatin is nicely bloomed, we're going to add that to our butterscotch mixture and then you're just going to let it sit for a little bit. So um, we're going to just help the gelatin kind of bloom some more in this mixture and then you want to mix it really, really well so that there's no gel gelatin granules because otherwise you'll have little grains um, in your mousse and you don't want that. So once it's really nicely mixed, you're going to refrigerate it for about an hour until it's nice and chilled and then we're going to make some heavy cream whipped cream. So I have some heavy cream, a little bit of salt, a little bit of sugar. I'm just going to whip that to moderately stiff peaks and then we're going to add the two together. So I'm just going to add a little bit of whipped cream to my butterscotch mixture then add that all into my whipped cream mixture. And then that is done. Our mousse is done and then I have some frozen store bought chocolate cake. I'm just going to cut lengthwise and then we're going to add a layer of cake, then my mousse, then cake right on top. So I have two layers of mousse and two layers of cake and then I'm just going to top it with some almonds and some more butterscotch chips. So that's it. And you just need to refrigerate it for about an hour and then you're all set. It's so lovely. This is such a nice, delicious dessert. So mousse and, and cake work so well together. The light and fluffiness of the mousse and then the dense, rich cake, especially the chocolate cake, is amazing. And then when you add caramel to your mousse, it's like a whole nother level of deliciousness. So I really hope you guys try it and then let me know what you think. And as always, the ingredients and instructions are in the description box below. Bye-bye.